favor puts aside your qualifications and removes boundaries that are set before you. Favor is the bread of the children, and anyone that has been named with Christ is eligible for this particular dimension of God's grace upon their lives. You are going to be chosen among others in your peers. You will see people running over themselves to serve you. The force of unusual favor will be upon your life, and you will watch as you rise and achieve things that others have deemed or termed impossible. It is not about what you know or who you know. It is about Christ's mark upon you. You will find that everything you lay your hands on works out successfully. Where others have tried unsuccessfully, you will succeed seamlessly and without so much effort. Yes, you will receive unusual favor today. You will get calls that will catapult you to great levels. Opportunities will open up to you. You will be remembered suddenly, picked from that low level that you find yourself and pushed into the limelight. All things are working out for you today and you will experience this favor in every areas of your life. As you receive favor in your job or career, you will also receive favor in your family, your marriage, your business, or academics. It is part of God's heritage for His children, so expect it. Expect to be favored. The blessings that you never dreamed of are coming your way, and places you have never thought to get to will be open to you. You will have access to great things and great people. You will see a turnaround in your life today. It's no longer business as usual. God is stepping into your case today and telling you to rest. It is not about your qualifications or what you can do. It's not about what you have or who you know. God himself will connect you to those that matter. People that will not stop until you have gotten that which God wants for you. He will go before you and make every crooked path straight. He will clear every mountain on your path, cause the waters to separate so you can walk on dry land. He will make things easy for you and you will not have to worry anymore about your situation. Favor will single you out among so many others. You will be preferred among your mates and equals. People may not even be able to place a finger on what it is that makes you stand out or special, but you should know that's favor at work in your life. It will give you access to things that you do not deserve. It will qualify you when you are not qualified. It will take you several miles ahead and help you achieve things with ease. Just as the scripture said, Men will come to your light and kings to the brightness of your rising. You will arise by favor and draw men to bless you by favor. You will surmount problems and receive help because of God's favor upon your life. God's favor will make men bless you. Look at the life of Solomon. He was already blessed by God and had riches and wealth in abundance. His kingdom was one that attracted many people from far and wide. They came to explore and see the greatness of Solomon. The interesting thing here is that these people still gave gifts to Solomon, blessing him the more. No matter what level you are now, God's favor will locate you and cause men to bless you from all angles. You may think you have gotten to certain heights in life. But there is somewhere greater and far better that God wants to take you to, and He will use men to help you to take to that level. This is just the beginning of what God will do for you, and He will not stop until you have gotten to the place where He wants you. You may be wondering if it is possible for you. You may have doubts as to whether you can ever be successful or get to that lofty position that you have dreamed of. Maybe you have stayed so long in that position or that condition that it feels almost impossible for any change to occur. You will be surprised at how God will turn your story around and bless you in an unusual manner. Your level notwithstanding, 
God will remember you for good today and cause men to bless you. Wherever your helpers are, they will have no time to rest until they have located you. Remember how King Ashwaris could not sleep a certain night and asked the books to be opened. That night, he recalled a deed that had been done by Mordecai and decided to reward him. Just like that, a mere servant at the king's court got to climb the royal horse and be announced around town by his enemy. He will also be remembered. It could be by your boss at your place at work or anybody for that matter. God can use your enemies as well to favor you. You see, they do not have a choice in this matter. They will be compelled to just help you whether or not they like it. They might even be planning things against you, but it will work out for your good in the end. That promotion that you have been looking forward to will come to you in no time. You will be called back where you have been previously rejected. You will be called for that position or the beautiful surprise. Wonderful things are waiting for you today, and God will not stop until you have gotten that which He has in stock for you. It is your time to be favored, your season to rise and shine. All of your sufferings and sorrow will soon become a thing of the past, that which you have been anticipating for a long time will finally be yours. You will step out of the darkness into the limelight. It does not take anything for God to change your story and bring your desired change. With just a word from His mouth, the angels will come running to help you. You will see power change hands in your life. The very people that have oppressed you in the past will be the ones to bless you. The ones that have hindered your progress will be the one clearing the path for you to move on. Just like God did with the children of Israel, God will also cause your enemies to favor you. They had been in the land of Egypt for a long time, in bondage and oppression, but when God favored them, the Egyptians were the ones begging them to leave and giving them all that they have asked. Just picture this in your case and apply it to your current predicament. The force of favor will make your enemies become friends. They will hasten your progress and help you achieve things that you have been trying. Your location does not matter either when God chooses to favor you. Mephibosheth had been a cripple for a long time, usually at the mercy of others. He probably had no hope of help from anywhere and made do with whatever came his way. However, King David remembered him because of his covenant with Jonathan. And just like that, his life changed and received a turnaround. He started eating at the king's table, enjoyed many more benefits. Your day to be remembered and favored has come. Get set to receive a surprise, a miracle, the blessings that you have been longing for. Beyond what you can think or imagine, beyond where you could ever reach by your power or strength, God will take you there today. Your story will be one to be remembered and told to inspire many others. The change that you have been waiting for is here. God has looked down from heaven and is deciding to favor you. You have been singled out for that blessing, for that promotion, for that contract, for that position. No man can stop God's favor in your life and you will see doors open to you. You will have access to great things, just as Esther enjoyed favor in the sight of all who saw her. So will you. You are moving across the ranks, climbing the ladder to great heights, where even your imaginations have not reached. God is taking you there. Expect it, because the Bible says that the expectations of the righteous shall not be cut short. It is your right and your inheritance as a child of God. And whatever you expect and pronounce is what you will get. So build up your faith and receive in your heart the unusual favor that is coming your way. You will surely see it manifest. People will be drawn to help you. Men and women will want to be associated with you. Favor will locate you wherever you happen to find yourself 
and you will receive blessings that will surprise you. All you need to do is have faith and launch out into the deep. Just as Christ told Peter to cast his net, and he enclosed so many fishes that his net began to break, so will you also experience a big and unusual catch today. Receive unusual favor today.